No, not at all. Uh, it's uh, a real issue, and it's not just the UK, it's uh, throughout the world. Uh, there has been a dangerous dysfunction between adaptation and, uh, and mitigation. Uh, the uh, people for whom climate change is, as it is for me, uh, the most material threat facing mankind, we have tended to be very tough on the mitigation because we can't see how we can achieve these ends without dealing with that. Uh, some of those who are much less convinced and some who are outright deniers um, have kind of been saying that you can do it all through adaptation. So they've almost tried to make a, a, a competitiveness of the, between these two. I think for a future government, making sure that DEFRA and DEC work very much more closely and trying to make that work more effectively. Above all, I'm afraid the Treasury is going to have to face up to the real cost of climate change. I mean, people talk about climate change as if it's happening at some future date. It's happening now. And that's why we have to spend more money on flood prevention. That's why we've got to learn about soft flooding uh, arrangements. So that's how we're going to have to re- uh, learn about wash meadows and uh, all sorts of other things which we've, we've lost. Um, and we're going to have to do that because the climate is changing and it is going to result in very many more incidents of particularly uh, difficult weather.